everybody. Joe for Joe Wins Project. Yeah, it is countdown to Christmas. This is vlog number seven. If I can hold up seven fingers real quick. And as you can tell, it's nighttime, but it's officially Wednesday, so I'm still safe. So we'll be right back right after this. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. wrapping up but the vlog is just starting I'm sorry if the camera's bumping up and down I'm going over a bridge here getting ready to pull into the dairy got to get checked in they have to look over the trailer you know all that good stuff we can drop the trailer and then go get some fuel and then we can leave and go home this is the best part of the night <laughs> so let's get in here and get checked in We'll get ready to get out of here. And as you can see right here, the uh, truck in front of me is getting checked in. And that little building right there is called the guard shack. Sorry for the fuzziness of the video. That's because it's dark. And you can only do what you can do. But as soon as they get this guy checked in, I'll be next. And then we can drop this trailer and then get out of here. Trailers drop. It's time to go get some fuel. Good God. My truck has got frost on it. Look, you can see the fall come out of my mouth. That's just sticking my head out the window. Golly. Man. I didn't know it done got that cold already. My gosh. Let's get that truck warmed up, man. Too cold to drive it like that. All right. Dropping the paperwork off. Good to go. Look at here. There's Mr. Buck. What's up, Buck? Come on, Joe. How you doing, man? I'm doing all right, man. How you doing, bro? Pretty good, man. How long you been working here? Uh, about 15 years. 15 years? Yeah. Where do you run to? I run at W. Lee Flyers down there in Lake City. Lake City? Yeah. Where is that? Like around close to between Florence and Myrtle Beach? Yeah, it's between Florence and Myrtle Beach. Okay, cool, man. So you like it here? Yeah, I like it pretty here. Good. Good deal, man. All right, well, you be careful out there. All right, brother Joe. We'll right, talk man. to you later, man. All right, man. All right, bye-bye. Oh uh, yeah, now I know why my truck had frost all over it. It is 26 degrees. Golly, man. It's cold. And as you can maybe tell on the video, I don't know, but as you, there's one right there. You see these ornaments lit up on the telephone poles. That's what that is. And they actually hung these ornaments like on November 1st. So they've been up for quite a while, so wow, the whole street down through there is lit up. They must have added some more because I haven't noticed that before. I've seen some here and there. And uh, so it's a pretty nice little added attraction for the holidays, wouldn't you say? I think it's pretty cool. One thing I can say about working the graveyard shift, when you come to these little towns at night, the cops love sitting out trying to hide to bust you for doing a little too much over the speed limit and believe me they don't mind doing it when I was a kid growing up there was a restaurant that my parents and I would frequent quite regularly and as I got older that restaurant chain faded away it was a restaurant called Shoney's I don't know if any of you are familiar with Shoney's but uh, there is a place down here that used to be a Shoney's. In just a second, 
I'll show you what it is now. Right here on the left, I don't know how you going good it's going to come across on video, but that building right there used to be Shoney's. And now it's a Chinese restaurant. It's actually pretty good. I've been there a few times and ate the buffet. Pleasantly surprised, I must say. Oh man, I believe I see the golden arches up ahead. Uh, for some reason, I have the craving for a couple of sausage biscuits. <laughs> I don't know why. This is, I don't know why, because usually I don't do breakfast stuff at night, but I feel like having a couple of sausage biscuits tonight. Now's as good a time as any, I reckon. Let's go ahead and get some. Hello? Is anybody home? <laughs> Can I get two sausage biscuits, please? Give me one oh, they said they'd be with me in a second. Wow. You get two sausage biscuits? Yes, ma'am. Two sausage biscuits. Anything else? That's it. All right. If they're not, the person does. Thank you. You're welcome. It's very surprising that McDonald's is this busy late at night. I don't know. I guess I'm not the only one working late hours. Unless everybody else is on vacation for the holidays. So, but for some reason, like I said, I just wanted a couple of sausage biscuits. Which works out good for me because all I have is $5. <laughs> so that's going to work pretty good. That's alright. It'll fill me up. I'll be good. Get home. Get a shower. Get ready to go to bed. It's all good. I'm not. I'm loving it. Okay, so you're not open 24 hours no more. Oh, okay. Very interesting. Just like, you know, in case you come or try to come, nobody can land. Yeah, yeah, uh, that's cool. That's no problem. Appreciate you letting me know that. No problem. Okay, have a good one. You too. All right. Well, uh, I got to the window and the girl said, here's the epidemic. We don't have any biscuits but I can give you a sausage, egg, and cheese McMuffin, two of them, and I won't charge you nothing extra. Sure, why not? <laughs> you know, that works for me, no problem. All right, folks, that's gonna wrap it up for me for this daily vlog number seven, countdown to Christmas. I'm still waiting on my food here at McDonald's, so. <laughs> I don't know how much longer I'll be here. I should be over halfway home by now. <laughs> so, thanks for watching, everybody. Be safe. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Take care of each other. God bless. Until next time, this is Joe for the Joe Wentz Project. Peace out.